上去。Watching a drone light show for the first time is a bit surreal. You don't know what's really behind all these lights that are moving in the sky. It's something that's a little magical, and it's something that I believe is a new form of nighttime entertainment for the industry. Intel got into drones in a very serendipitous way. We were just talking in the hallway about how cool it would be to have 100 drones form the Intel logo above our headquarters. We knew that was something that was technically challenging. So we said, well, how do we engineer a solution to this? We wanted to see how we could fly 100 drones with one pilot, and that was about three years ago. We flew the first shot in Germany, and then we said, let's push this a little bit more. What else can we do with this technology? So this is the Intel Shooting Star drone, and what we've done at Intel here is we've built a drone just for drone light shows. You'll see that there's no cameras. It does two things really well. It has a light that can create over four billion color combinations in the sky, and it flies really precise in the sky, so you can just paint any animation you want in the night sky. The control center understands the states of all of the drones that we have here. So if you select a specific drone, you can actually see the battery life, the GPS, the temperature, and so forth. So that's how we know that the drone is healthy and stable to fly. We actually have a setting on the drone where we can actually change it as quickly as we want. And this is really important when we do shows because if we want to send out a, a flash of light for any external aircraft, we can sh shine the whole fleet bright red. We have a lot of special IP and special algorithms that allow us to fly and control all of these drones with just one pilot. Everything is pre-programmed so we know exactly where these drones are going to fly and we test it through our simulator before we fly. We believe that we're really pushing the forefront of technology and we can change how the industry as well as aviation and regulators look at how to fly drones because of the technology that we have. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.